And here I am, entering the ring. Look at me, how young. Ten years ago, I can't believe it. Smiling at the camera, jumping into the ring, and watch my pants. <laughs> they were really funny. They actually asked me a few fights later to uh, remove those pants, and they gave me different kinds of. But you will see that we all got to go through it. I'm waiting for my opponent now, Ryushi Yanagisawa which was uh, 45 pounds heavier. This is a funny story. I came to America, I actually, I came to Japan, and there I thought I was going to fight five rounds of three minutes. So I asked the people, I told them, I said, uh, how many rounds are we going to fight? They say, one round. I said, one round, that's great. And then I said, how many minutes is going to be? And they say, 30 minutes. I said, oh, that's great, that's great. But in my mind, I thought, oh my God, 30 minutes. I can't do this. Anyway, how much is my opponent's weight? Now, I came from Thai boxing, and in Thai boxing, five pounds difference is a different weight class. And he was 45 pounds heavier, so I thought, oh my God, I'm gonna face this guy, 45 pounds heavier, 30-minute um, fights, I was a hothead. I could lose my cool in the beginning of the fight, so I made these big R's, I wrote them with a marker on the back of my hands and you will see him later on and it means relax rustic stay relaxed because if you're gonna shoot you load in the beginning of the fight and there are 25 minutes more to fight you might lose the fight so you gotta relax and pace down yes that's exactly how they pronounce my name very strange Ryushi Yanagisawa. The referee put us together. A few last tips. See if I got some hidden weapons somewhere. I obviously don't. The good thing about this fight was that he was taller than I was. So uh, with palm strikes, palm strikes to the head are only allowed in Pancras. That was a good thing. You will find out later. Shake hands and here we go. Oh, nice block there. And now, right high kick. And that's the palm strike. Oh, that's gotta hurt. This was a big surprise for the people because he was the number four ranked fighter in Japan at that time. Now I was thinking, what do I do to bring his head down, his hands down? He goes down, I choose for the kick to the body, the liver kick, I followed it up with the right straight and then I gave him a right knee to the head. We will see it in the slow-mo. And this is where the rooting jump was born. I was so excited, I jumped up to all four corners with the rooting jump and from that moment on, I had to make the rooting jump every time I had a victory. Yes, this was a serious knockout. I was kind of concerned here because his eyes were still open and um, he didn't move at all. It took, a, it took a long time. He will stand up and then he will fall down again and then he stood up again and he fell down again until they had to call the ambulance and they had to drive him to the hospital. These are the less fun things of fighting. Sometimes some things go too hard and um, let's face it, we're all professional fighters and we don't want to have this. There we are, 43 seconds. Little show time. You see, he went down again. It was uh, pretty serious. I got a, a fax from the doctor. They had a CT scanning of the brain. They went into an uh, MRI. He spent two days in the hospital. It was, um, yeah, it was scary. I, uh, I didn't want to leave Japan until I knew that he was right, that he was okay.
I couldn't believe it. The audience was actually applauding for me. I mean, I'm like this guy from Holland beating a Japanese fighter and the people were actually applauding for me. Try that to do in Holland. I mean, they will boo you and will throw cans of beer at you. A little crazy there, a little hyped. Hey, what can I do? First fight, first victory. And here we go in slow motion this time. Right high kick with the right palm strike. Bang! To the head. Yep, that hurts. Okay, now I was thinking I gotta bring his hands down because obviously he's gonna put his hands up. I just knocked him down. With what shall I do it? Kick to the body, kick to the legs. And as you can see, ooh, it was a kick to the body. Followed up with a right hand again and a right knee to the head. And this was the end of the match.